some of y'all just too educated, too educated, too educated. Too educated. Too educated, too educated. Especially when it comes to God's word. It's really simple. It's really simple. It's really simple. Uh, if you notice a lot of reverends and people that spoke the word back in the 60s, 70s, and 40s, uh, what have you, guess what they didn't have? They didn't have no education, no education like we have today. Some of them couldn't read or write, which is why sometimes you had their wife who could read or write, read the scripture, and then they will repeat it. They was in, one thing about them, they was in tune uh, with God. That's how they spoke a powerful sermon, because God spoke to them. See, you going out here getting so educated and allow yourself to be educated, really education is only for the world. See, just pay attention, pay attention carefully. If you were meant and called by God to preach his word, he, God himself, God himself would give you the words to preach from the scripture that he wants you to preach from. See? You don't have to have all these high degree, uh, educated degrees and high intellect and all that because he is the educator. He will give you the word to speak to the people that you are preaching to. No need to, for all these big words. Matter of fact, I just give you an example. One time I went to a church, I went to Puritan, I was at Puritan Missionary Baptist Church. I was there and they had a guest speaker and I got lost, I got lost. I got lost mainly because he was using big words and he didn't explain them, uh, just using big words. And I was like, oh, okay, that, that's what he owned. I, I don't know if I need to say amen or you know what what's going on. Cause I, you know, I don't know. They say God's word is supposed to be simple enough for a baby to understand it. And I'm gonna tell you one thing about God, it is simple enough where a baby can understand it because I'll tell you a story about a baby who got popped in his mouth by his mama. Got popped in his mouth by his mama. <clears throat> well, the baby didn't know it, but when he got wind of it, he heard about it, so he had to go ask his mama. If that was true. Well, he go ask his mama if it was true. Sure enough, she was ashamed about it. Then she said, yeah, I smacked, I smacked that baby in the mouth because he bit me. The baby never bit me again. All right, I'm done.